Bangalore, May 23rd, Fanish Murthy would be sued as a gate employee, who was learned to be pregnant with his child. Accused him of sexually harassing her, days after Murthy's statement overruling all allegations against him. California-based law firm appointed by Araceli Rowe has disclosed information regarding its clients. Pregnancy, according to the press release of the law firm, Murphy had asked Roiz to terminate pregnancy. However, Roiz, who was investor relations chief in the gate, refused to do. The press release says, when she refused, he told her to leave the company quietly to protect his position as CEO. Speaking about relationship between Murphy and Roiz, the release says. Murphy was able to induce Miss Rowe's into behavior and action that she would have found unthinkable at the beginning of her employment, dismissing Murphy's statement that their relationship began just a few months ago. The release said the CEO of any company, as Mr. Murphy was here, has tremendous economic and personal power over his subordinates. Thus, Ms. Rowise was dependent on her continued employment for her basic living expenses and, further, Mr. Murphy conditioned her further employment and career advancement opportunities on her entering into a relationship with him which, eventually and reluctantly, she did, it added, the release also added. When she tried to extricate herself from the relationship, he reduced her responsibilities, threatened her continued employment, and pressured her to continue the relationship, despite sacking Murphy following the sexual harassment allegations against its former CEO. A gay too would face legal actions, the release said, under California law. Because Mr. Murphy was an officer and director of a gate, his actions were the actions of a gate. And a gate, too, is liable for the acts of Mr. Murphy. There remains the question of whether, given Mr. Murphy's history of predatory actions toward female employees, a gate did all that it should have done to oversee and control Mr. Murphy and to provide some method for women at a gate to report his actions. The release added, 49-year-old Murphy earlier had claimed, I am not certain if the employee will file harassment charges in court. I will fight all harassment charges vigorously in court. I have not received the letter. Only company has received the complaint. This was the second time when Murphy was asked to leave IT company following some sexual harassment allegations. Earlier he was asked to leave IT major Infosys. However, the case was settled out of court in 2002, after leaving Infosys. Murphy launched his own company called Quintant which later was bought by Gate in Org 2003. A gate now has appointed Gerard Watsinger as interim chief executive for the immediate effect.